Hello everyone and welcome to my physical education site. My name is Coach Figueroa and I decided to focus this site specifically on the weight training and fitness unit in physical education. This unit targets grades 9 through 12 and it covers 11 of the California content standards. This site is intended to provide students with information and resources regarding weight training and fitness. There are resources that can be useful to students that will help them study the anatomy and physiology of the human body in order to understand how the body functions. There are also links to websites that will help viewers along with their fitness journey. This is also a great tool for students to contact me if they have any questions after class ends. And here students will be able to see a short video that I created about myself and who I am as a physical educator. Okay, so what exactly is physical education? As a brief breakdown, it is a class that is taught in elementary, middle, and high school that focuses on the development of physical fitness while also teaching students to enjoy day-to-day -day physical activities. Physical education is important because it promotes psychomotor learning in a play or movement setting. It promotes a fit, healthy lifestyle for them to take well into adulthood for lifelong health. As a physical educator, I am aiming to have students achieve enjoyment in physical activities that they take part of, also to challenge students in physical, psychological, and social aspects in order for student development to occur. Here you'll find 11 useful links that will help better tie in the weight training and fitness unit. There are a variety of safety, nutrition, bullying, and general weight training information links. I believe them all to be great links for both students and parents to look into and learn from. For example, the sport injury link is a guide to safety for young athletes that talks about different types of injuries, strategies to prevent injuries, and special considerations. Overall, I strongly encourage both students and parents to look into these links as the weight training and fitness unit carries on. Interactives are different ways for students to incorporate technology into learning. One interactive I've decided to share with my students is my fitness pal. This allows students to take control over their goals by tracking calories, breaking down food ingredients, and allow for activity logging. Another interactive is Quizlet which allows for easy studying and easy creation of study sets. It allows for easy studying of terminology, which can add up, and it breaks down topics in a very effective manner. The third interactive is Teach PE Quizzes, which allows students to test their knowledge with interactive quizzes that vary anywhere from physical training to different systems of the body. The fourth and final interactive, which is Free Workout Log, allows for easy goal setting, workout logs, shows progress, and shows results. Assistive technologies are designed to help students who have certain disability continue to learn effectively. One great adaptive technology in physical education is adapted equipment. To ensure students with special needs have an array of specialized equipment to utilize, physical educators may order adapted products. There are jumbo tennis rackets, oversized footballs, ringing soccer balls, therapy games, and also safe and soft play balls. Another great adaptive technology is the Quictionary pen. This pen helps struggling readers by reading a single word or a whole line of text aloud. It is a great tool to allow students with difficulties to keep up with their reading and learning throughout the school year. Internet safety is an important topic for everyone to be aware of, no matter the age. The internet is filled with a vast amount of information, websites, images, and videos. It is important to know how to be smart when online. McAfee is an antivirus software that ensures easy web browsing without the fear of viruses. It is a great tool for easy virus cleanup. I have attached a link to the Be Internet Awesome Google page will help which helps kids, teens, parents, and educators be safe and confident online. I have also attached an internet safety link to help parents understand internet safety laws and protection tools. 
Here you will find the weight training goal setting project which is intended to help students develop and create a set of personal fit physical fitness goals that will improve their performance in weight training and fitness. This assignment is to be completed over the course of the entire unit. Students will be asked to create a set of personal fit fitness goals, design their own workout program, and turn in a reflection. Here you will find the two worksheets that students will be required to fill out. The first worksheet is the goal setting worksheet which makes it easy for students to fill out their four goals. And this worksheet is the workout program sheet that students will use to create their own workouts with. Okay. And here you'll find the examples that I personally filled out uh, both worksheets with. Um, it shows what is expected from students. And finally, here I have the grading rubric. And you'll find the point breakdown of the project. I have also provided in detail what is what I expect and what grades to expect based off of student work. I have also provided two web pages that will be useful for students to fill out their goal setting and workout program worksheets. You'll find two assessments, a formative and a summative assessment. The formative assessment is a 15 question quiz which evaluates a progressive level of student thinking. It covers several muscles on the anterior and posterior side of the body. As you can see here, I have provided a link to take the quiz and also with simple instructions. The summative assessment will be the presentation of the student's four week goal and workout plan. This will help students develop their presentation skills and present their reflections during their four week journey. Here you'll find the presentation directions and the grading rubric, which provides details of what I expect. The weight training and fitness tic-tac-toe adds in a little fun to the unit. There are nine total challenges and students will be asked to complete any three challenges that create a tic-tac-toe line. Students will be assessed based off their completion of the line, their ability to provide video proof on an iPad or phone, and based off of effort and dedication. Here, you'll find a downloadable copy of the Tic-Tac-Toe Challenges worksheet. And here you'll find the directions and point distribution breakdown for the assignment. And finally, here you'll find the introductory lecture into weight training and fitness. It is intended to introduce students into the unit and to provide students with basic knowledge of the human muscular system. It also teaches students anatomical muscular system and training terminology. Here you'll find the original PowerPoint presentation I utilized to record my lecture and a PDF version of the slides. During this lecture, students should utilize the guided notes as their note-taking tool. They will be asked to fill out the blank spaces as the lecture continues on. They would also utilize the provided images of the human muscular system to label the major muscles that will be discussed during the lecture. Finally, I also provided an online version of the guided notes for an online, easy online editing. 